Hey, what's up, y'all? My name is Jeffrey Mitchell, as y'all know. And I'm standing here in the rain at the Metro Orange Line Station. Get ready to jump on the train and go to work and do that thing. Just wanted to holler at y'all. Let y'all know, see how it go in the rain. And let you know another one of my women has another man, I guess, officially this weekend. I had a very good weekend, and I kind of do. But my primary uh, communication contact and my most intimate friend uh, from New Mexico has found herself a man. Just like I predicted she would. I met her over a year ago. And, you know, I told her some things were going to change for her and me. And I told her not to fall in love with me. And I was always honest with her. And, and it seems now we both got everything we wanted, you know, out of the relationship. I told her that I wanted her to take me from point A to point B. And some certain things that she did. And she said she wanted to move, get a house, and get a man. And she did. And she called me Saturday morning. Well, I called her Saturday morning because she wasn't calling me because I knew they was out together probably even before they even knew they was out together. But, you know, the whole thing is, we did about a year of uh, a very intimate friendship we had. You know, we did freaky stuff on the phone. And, you know, we were kind of remotely sexually involved and stuff. So... And that's how that goes. But now, you know, she found somebody local who can help her and her family. Help her do the things that she needs to do. Because I told her from day one, I wasn't the one. I ain't the one to do the day-to-day -day shit. That's just not me at all. I don't, um, I don't be, I don't be, I ain't the one. I ain't the one to be, you know, doing that day-to-day -day shit. That's not Jeffrey. But that's why I say all these women have men. You know, I even written, I wrote a couple years ago that, some of these women are just so beautiful and fine, they need attention. Attention that I ain't doing, I ain't gonna give them. I mean, they like fine art, you know? I love, um, who's my boy, Rougeau and all them paintings, famous paintings, but I don't want the famous paintings in my house, you know, to, to have to take care of them and stuff. I don't want that, you know? I would rather have it put away in a gallery and I go visit it every now and then. And that's the way I like it, you know? That's the way I like in uh, the men in my women's life. You know, they, they take care of them and I get my piece, you know. I go to the gallery and get my piece. Am I too dark in this son of a bitch? Am I even showing up anyhow? That was about it, so I'm happy for her. And I really was happy for her. So I got so fucking happy Saturday, I started crying. And I even knew she was... Uh, you know, I knew she was with another man. I knew it. I called. I was like, so where you at? What happened? Da -da -da. And it was overwhelming because it was just the way I predicted it. You know, like almost literally just down to the detail and everything, you know. So I just wanted to holler. Get that out there. I'm alone again. And the, and, and the funny part about it, I was saying today, I'm alone to be with who? I'm alone to be with my best friend. Imagine that. You get... You get left out alone, you get to be alone with your best friend, you know. So even when I'm by myself, I'm with the person who I would most likely rather to be in my list is white, and I don't give a damn anyway, because my name is Jeffrey Mitchell, and I just be swinging all up and down on it. Peace.